bitches on the beat. I'm a 
outside in an AMG Right outside, PT Two turn baby girl, you know me Still with the girls that I grew beside All the niggas brown, you know I hear they die Gotta watch the time, cause it's fine right by I'm outside in an AMG Right outside, PT Two turn baby girl, you know me Who am I? All the niggas around me, right at the time Gotta watch the time, cause it's fine right now Two turn baby girl, you know me I just caught a shorty up a fan star Just threw on a hoodie, it's a Crenshaw Way that I've been living unconventional I'm just trying to make it to the end, you know Certain things have started getting pissed off Think we need to have a sun adventure I could be a man, but maybe down the road Right now, I'll be able to see my heart from the
Today is actually New Year's Day, January 1st, officially 2023. Bringing in the new year, as you guys seen, it was so fun. I had so much fun. Um, and I put it in the way I would want the rest of my year to flow. Just around positivity, laughter, fun. So that was a great way to bring in the new year. And um, so today I'm about to head to New York. Just doing something real comfortable. Sweatsuit Uggs. Tie my hair back some. The Louis earrings and we're good to go. So I'm gonna um head out now. The weather is pretty nice. It's 50 degrees here in New Jersey. Well that's good because it's been cold and rainy. Um, last night it was actually raining a lot and really, really foggy. So, today we get sun. And, um, I'm going to check back in with you guys in a few. I think this should be fine. Okay, we made it into the car. So let's hit the road, Jack. Let's see how this New York traffic is because that is really annoying. That's one thing about New York. The traffic is extremely annoying and it is extreme, extremely congested. So let's see what it's hitting for today. How was you guys New Year's? Well, how was you guys New Year's Eve going into the new year? Like, how was that for you? For the for the um, new year, we have to start being a little bit selfish. Selfish with everything. <laughs> Our time. And everything. Learn to say no. Like, start napping more. I love me a nap because there's some people that don't take naps I don't even know how you guys are functioning not taking a freaking nap it's crazy like I've been off of work since um the week before the last week in December and I literally been taking a nap every day because of course if you're working it's kind of hard to take a nap on your work days um, so I've been napping every day. When I go back, I know I'm going to be exhausted. I just feel like they need to cut these days, these work days short. Like, times change. Why are we working so freaking long? Like, you work all these hours and you don't have no personal time for your family, for yourself. To do nothing, just freaking work. Come home, you know, probably spend like an hour or two with your family and then bed, wake up, back to work. Like, work day should be about from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. Seriously. And I, and I say most jobs, you know? Like, cut these shifts shorter, but still pay good money. Headed to the gas station right now before I um, get on this road. But yeah, what do you guys think about that? Like cutting this work day short. I was just having this conversation with my sister because you don't have no time. Like these, this of course for the people that that uh, actually work maybe nine to fives or just regular jobs. Um, because I'm sure 
whatever you have your own business and things like that some type of businesses you make your own times that you want to go to work or whatever so that's good those people probably get to spend enough time with their family but even the school day for children like it's too long like when do you have time for yourself I am so tired probably can't tell but I'm extremely tired I actually mixed drinks last night and you shouldn't do that like I especially shouldn't do that like I don't know if it come with age but like when I mix no so I had dark liquor first I normally do tequila I had dark liquor first and then I switched to tequila three different brands and I wonder why I'm so exhausted right now right all right y'all I may grab this gas really quickly and I'm gonna come right back one good thing for the new year, the gas price went down. Look, it's $2.99 here. That is what's up. We're getting back into the swing of things. So that's good. So we made it into the car. Good morning. It's the first day back to work. I'm running a little bit behind time because I'm trying to start the new year off on a good foot. And when I say good foot, I mean going to work being more me right because you know how sometimes we we just get comfortable like you see those memes where it was like how I look at work versus when I'm going out let's make it a habit to look like that all the time instead of just when we're going out so I, I'm running late because I just, well, I'm not really running late, but just a little bit behind. Oh, it's dark. Just a little bit behind um, the time I would normally be leaving for work. So that's the situation. So I want to start making a little bit more time in the mornings to do my makeup a little bit. Just something soft, nothing crazy. Um... We have this habit of like just feeling blah and going about our day. And you know, when you look good, you feel good, right? You perform better. And you guys see those memes going around with a with a uh, the women be looking crazy going to Walmart, and they come back and they be like, "What happened at Walmart? I couldn't find what I needed. So what you gonna do now? I'm gonna go get dressed and go to Target." Like, I think we should be intentional and, like, get dressed no matter where we're going. Like, always show up and show out. Like, let's treat everywhere we go like we're going to Target. So, um, I'm going to try to um, 
or I will get into that and get into the to the hang of that because like why not so yeah that's the situation like let's just start even if you're going down the block to, to the store a quick drive to um Walmart 99 cents wherever like I don't care if it's those places like get up get yourself together look presentable and yeah that's how we're gonna be doing it for 2023 so yeah I'm on my way to work I don't know if I'm gonna bring you guys in with me but if I don't thank you for tuning in if you're new here welcome I hope you hit that subscribe button and um I'm not gonna ever do that because I appreciate when things are good. You know what I'm saying? It'd be like just in any second some shit could happen that's fucked up. So in between those moments that you can't control, you have to enjoy life to the fullest. hundred percent. But sometimes I think that's like normal a lot of people do that but let me um let me start getting my day in order make sure the lesson plans and stuff like that is in order okay, whatever i need to do I hate when you leave somewhere but I leave work and then you come back and stuff is not sticking to the wall and stuff like that. So then you have to repaste things and whatever. So yeah, um, I think I'm gonna end it here for real. <laughs> I just wanted to bring you guys with me this morning. See how my mornings go when it comes to working. So thanks for tuning in. If you're new here, like I said, make sure you subscribe, like, comment, and the chat down at the bottom. Until next time.